And uh, the hatch on the Soyuz MSO2 is now closed. The Soyuz uh, was placed on autonomous power uh, about an hour or so ago. All of its systems are reported in excellent shape, and now uh, Oleg Novitsky is in the process of closing the Poisk hatch. Again, 7.45 a.m. Moscow time, 11.45 p.m. Central time, the Soyuz hatch closed, and now the Poisk module hatch has been closed uh, one and a half minutes later. So both hatches are now closed, setting the stage for the undocking of the Soyuz from the International Space Station. We are ready to reset the status. Me mechanical contact is not illuminated. We have the physical separation confirmed right on time at 2.57 and 30 seconds central time. 2.57 and 30 seconds central time, 3.57 and 30 seconds eastern time. The first of the uh, separation burns is scheduled uh, about a minute and a half from now. We have the ball activation. Yes, we are monitoring. Eight seconds burn. A good view of the uh, engine firing on the Soyuz vehicle. An eight second burn. This is the first of two separation burns to increase uh, the opening rate by about a half a meter per second. Good image. We have, we don't have GSO-1. Now we have GSO-1-2, and we are standing by for burn number two. We have an increase. We have the Standing by for the second of the two separation burns, the Soyuz flying 256 statute miles over the border between northeastern uh, China and southeastern Russia. And we are moving along the USOS. And, uh, and the visiting vehicle officer and mission control reports a good second separation burn. So the Soyuz is on its way. 